What's happening everybody? This is CY2 Squared and in today's video we are going to talk about how to kill the great carp and it's kind of tricky um, but you can get a hint from this vendor. He may or may not give the dialogue I want him to give because sometimes they only give it once. We come to another pot vendor. Did you bring me any scales? If you have any, I'll reward you handsomely. <laughs> Most of my scales have returned, and I owe it all to you. Finally, the time has come for him to pay the price for his crime. But scales are priceless. It's almost as if I'm priceless too. <laughs> okay, so who he's referring to is the other pot vendor at the Harata estate. He says, time for him to pay for his crimes. And he he's apparently not gonna repeat it, but he told us before in previous dialogue that the other pot vendor tried to kill the great carp. He wants the great carp scales so he can turn into a big carp himself, right? I'll do it one more time to see if he mentions it. You there, you've done a remarkable job thus far. I feel that I can rely on you. Will you listen to my tale? Or rather, my secret? Uh, okay, didn't expect this, but we'll include this in the video as well. <laughs> sure. Oh, wonderful. Truly remarkable. Now, the secret I mentioned. I'd like you to present this bait to the great car. Not let anyone see if you can help it. Be as stealthy as possible. Okay. So, uh, Bait has hair. You know it's something truly special. The Fountain Palace Noble and the Pot is obsessed with becoming one with the Master. Present the Bait to the Master, the Great Carp. Offer it earnestly, but quietly, so no one knows. Do that, and I'll bestow upon you the Palace's secret treasure. So this is interesting. Apparently, there are two different ways you can kill the Great Carp. One is go back to the Harata estate after you've been to the Divine Realm, after you've been near the carp, when you go back to the Harata estate, the vendor will smell the carp on you and he'll offer you a poisonous bait in which you can kill the carp with. Only after you've been here, been near the carp, traveled back to the Harata estate, and spent seven scales purchasing items from him. I did not know that this guy also presents you with poisonous bait. I'm gonna go this route because I'm kind of curious what the palace treasure is. Hello again. Take care with that bait. Present it to the great car. And remember, do it quietly. Be as stealthy as possible. Mm -hmm. Do that, and I'll bestow upon you the palace's secret treasure. <laughs> Hello again. Take care with that bait. Quietly. Very, very quietly. <laughs> I'm tempted to actually go back to the Arata estate. He would give us poisonous bait as well. And then see, but I don't know if you can choose which path, you know what I'm saying? Like, if they give me the same bait, whose side quest would I be fulfilling? So I'm just going to stick with this guy, and we're going to hop down there and feed the fish. Um, let's see, where do we need to go? Palace Grounds? And by the way, if you didn't know how to reach this area of the level, I'm about to show you. It's fairly simple, but it is easy to miss. See, I knew that you could get the poison bait from the guy at the Rata Estate because the last time I talked to the pot vendor here, he said, oh, he tried to kill the carp. And I was like, oh, okay, so maybe if we go back and talk to him, now that we've been near the carp, you know, he'll help us kill it. But apparently they both want to kill it. Hypocrite, man, hypocrite. 
calling the other guy a criminal. And here he is wanting to kill him himself. So jump. And then just jump out here. We should be able to hook to that. Now. Let me get over here and take this guy out. Oh, you butthole. You are being a real butt munch. Oh, I, I always forget that I have the... The anti-air death blow. Okay, we don't want anybody watching us. And I wanted to look around here to see if there's any items anyway. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ooh, just barely missed me. I know there's another dog around here. And a booshki. I don't think the dogs are going to tell anybody. You're a slippery little bee. Sounds like they're about to vomit. Okay. So when you head down here, you can talk to an NPC. And he's going to tell you that you can feed the fish. I I'm wondering if we maybe need to... Could we kill him? Buddy, Master feed it. the bell must be wrong. Okay, thanks for the advice. Let's go ahead and rest here because I forgot the last time. So, all we got to do is go over here, ring the bell, the fish will come up, we give it the poison. The interesting thing, and I think my mic may have just cut out. The interesting thing is, um, like I said, I did not know that both vendors were trying to kill this fish. I thought that just the Harata vendor was trying to kill it. Alright, now let's select the truly precious bait. Oh, so you can. You can decide which which person you want to do it. Well, let's go ahead and use the guy. Should we go back to Harata? Or just... Let's just go ahead and use this pot noble's bait. I'm going to follow that fish. Or, you know what? We'd probably have to rest. I bet we have to rest before we find out. I was like one hit away from killing the headless down here, and I died, and I was so salty. Well, where did he go? Okay, we need to head over in this direction. You just barely see the tip of this house. Oh, and there's an item on this. Lump of grave wax, cool. Uh, 
Okay, now we're off in the right direction. Make sure there's no more items I missed back here. I didn't see that you could go in up here. No items, though. Okay, so now we're going down in the carp's hidey hole. Alright, he's still very much alive, so we're probably going to have to rest. Come on, you big galoof. Where you at? There he is. Really? So we'll wait for him again to turn around. And then we'll go rest, and then we'll jump back in, and yeah, he should be dead, I would assume. Same thing again. I caught that. <laughs> that was kind of cool. Alright, back down. And... Well, there's an NPC here. Master. 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 Where are you? going nuts do nothing can I kill you Master. Master. man he's really upset <laughs> he's really upset isn't he yeah he's not there okay now let's dive down and see if we can find him Which way was it? Was it over here? No? It was over this way. There we go. There's the entrance to his house. <laughs>
I think Master has a tummy ache. There's an item all the way down here. Light coin purse. That's got nothing to do with it. Well, crap. Apparently he went out maybe further in the deep to die. You son of a... Huh! Any items around here? Maybe we need to go out further in the deep? Okay, I did not plan on making this long of a video. I kind of figured it wouldn't be that difficult to find the fish. Master. Okay. Looks like we're going on a wild goose chase. The noble pot vendor wants you to bring him the carp scales. But we may have to go talk to him first. There's something way down there. Nope, that's the headless. We can travel back to the noble pot vendor. Because I'm not seeing a dead fish anywhere. Maybe the carp scales will not appear until you go back and talk to the vendor that makes no sense though if the fish went off and died you would want to retrieve the scales and then take them to the vendor
let's find out what he has to say. I wish I would, would have known this all along. I could have saved myself about 10 minutes of video. Oh, you dirty, rotten prick. So we do the dirty deed, and then he goes and collects the scales and leaves, leaves us La Paz Lazuli. Which, you, which is a final upgrade. Like, if you want to totally max out your prosthetic tool, you're going to need... Well, depending on how many prosthetic tools you want to fully upgrade, you're going to need several of those. I think I now have four. So I would say that that does it. That little grimy prick goes and collects the carp scales. At least he left us a treasure, though. I think maybe he's, uh, like, Patch's ancestor. <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe he turns into the carp and we can go kill him. Oh, I can talk to him. And he's got red eyes. And now he turns into a vendor. <laughs> That'll sell you all the mask fragments. That's cool. I have 18. If I had one more scale, I could actually buy the right and left. So. Oh my god, one more scale and I can buy the right and left mask fragment. That'll be in another video. I will go farm for a scale. And then I guess I'll show you guys what the mass fragments are for. This video turned out better than I thought. I just wish that I had the editing software to chop out the middle. so Because I highly doubt many people are going to make it this far. But if you did, go ahead and subscribe. Leave a like and a comment. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.